video games. There's no future in that shit. Start. Fuck, let's move. <laughs> they want to light fire drill? Let's go. Oh, these just fuck you. Know.
Let's see what the Reds are really up to. Bell, hop on that terminal. Start poking around. Welcome to the Soviet People's Warfare Analysis Archive. Operation Greenlight. Restricted access. What the fuck is Operation Greenlight? Bell, can you hack into that? Of course there's a password. Look around. These reds ain't that smart. Maybe there's something on the desk. Nice. I'm grabbing a copy. This doesn't make any sense. Percy's infiltrated a CIA nuke program, codenamed Operation Greenlight. Run by Hudson. Stolen nuke is American. And Hudson fucking knew. Shit. Find him again. I want to hijack. I can't fucking believe it. Clark, come in. Clark. Hudson lied to us. Fucking lied to us. Talking about green light. That's what Perseus is after. And Hudson has his fingerprints all over it. What's the break up? Just get the hell out of it!
lock in the exit. We're gonna have to punch the rule. Yes, sir, I'm on it. You knew this! 
the nuke was from green light. Didn't tell us. What else are you hiding? Maybe I can knock the truth out of you. You might want to rethink that, Woods. Everybody stand down. This little pissing match isn't going to help us catch Perseus. Why didn't you tell us it was an American nuke? He needed us to clean up his mess. The bastard's been lying to us all along. It's not a lie. It's an omission of fact. That's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced if the Reds moved on Europe, we couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight, a top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. 74, the bombs were upgraded to high yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. You're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people, but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? One of the green light nukes went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So, there's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Killed Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods. We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park, anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamantau, I want it more. The first building is just over that ridge. Thanks, Dimitri. We'll radio we found the mainframe. Woods, you know what the KGB does to double agents. Yep. Da. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. Hey, I've only one hour of fuel. So after that, you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's get moving, Mason. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar fool you. Dimitri's kosher enough. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Hell, he buried half. on the ridge line. We do this quiet, Mason. Yeah, you're the expert in quiet. Hey, I'm a complicated man. Good kill. No, let's keep moving. You 
take one, I'll get the other. Good kill. Hopefully nobody heard. It's a long way down. Let's hope the Reds know how to tie a zip line. <sighs> I hope this holds. SATCOM building. Looks like it's taken by a thread. Clear kill. Let's keep moving. my damn gun. You're going first next time. You 
see a tunnel down here. You'll have to find another way inside. Copy that. Stay sure. Woods. Great. Damn, it's cold in here. Huh. Crossbow bolt. Это место было заброшено после схода лавины. Я слышал, что при раскопках были найдены тела с пулевыми ранениями. Ты что? Хочешь сказать, что наше начальство скрыло вражескую атаку на советской земле? Yeah, I read you. You gotta be close.
Давай, он же у тебя. Я думал, он у тебя. Идиот, как мне его отправить? You made. I'm surprised the entire Soviet Union ain't up our ass. You've been busy. That's what they pay me for. In here, Chief. Bingo. That crane matches the dick site on this map. That's where we need to go. Have you found the mainframe? There's a big crane on the west side of the base. Have your winch ready. Excuse me? My, my winch? Sorry, you're breaking up. We <laughs> got a crane. The rest of the Pin down! You got any guns on that? 
hole this time. Hudson. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamatau. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're going to find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know, but we're going to do this the right way, or we're not going to do it at all. Just got word. Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. Bell, you with me. Lazar, be ready for Exfil. Are you taking her into the KGB with you? Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. She's got the skill we need. Are you 
you enjoying this? You're risking the entire operation unnecessarily. It's not unnecessary. It's calculated. Just understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. Larger came in. I set it up in the dark room for you. Curious. Does the name Madame Shell mean anything to you? Yeah. Sounds familiar. <laughs> There's intel crisscrossing ARPANET that her body washed up along the Padillos River in Cyprus. Huh. That's so. And her head, two kilometers downstream. Reports estimate her death around August of last year. Of all places, you were on assignment in Cyprus this past summer. <coughs> coincidence, wouldn't you say? Our line of work is full of coincidences. MI6 was keen on finding her. The rogue double agent on dark experiments. The Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Hello, Belikov на трубке. summons to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. I'm sorry. You just have to go. Yeah, Did the general come through here? Okay. This is as far as I can take it. Seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. There's a mole within the KGB. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. 
and thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov, as head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mood. How is that gone? <coughs> I am not a patient man, Bilikov, or a compassionate one. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, you Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? <clears throat> Sound thinking, Comrade Belikov. I would prefer it if only General Charkov retains his bunker key. So you will see to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. The traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed. I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Have you ever been to Poland? Yes. Sorry. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted here, I'll blow my cover. Now I need to hide the body. I have to get a bunker key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. <sighs> Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? The general will be questioning a prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. <clears throat> Just let me know when you're ready to meet with him. I have a chance to kill Cherkov. Kravchenko's office will have the poison I need.
Maybe there's a clue to the combination somewhere in the office. What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? Of course, right this way. Go ahead and take a seat. He won't be long. Yes. <laughs> no, tell Nikita no one else trusts him either. Why do you think no one wants I to play the rock with him if you need anything else? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yes, I am a busy man. Thanks for noticing. Me too, you too. I'll call you tomorrow. <clears throat> Dimitri, what's on your mind? <laughs> you were the better pilot, let's admit it. But yes. I missed that part of it. Sad to think we only fly desks now. <clears throat> the same, mostly. Still begging me to retire early to the country. <laughs> Ridiculous, isn't it? Moscow is my home now. If there was something before, I'd hardly know it. <clears throat> to us, Comrade Belikov, two old warriors still stumbling their way through the dark. <laughs> Tell me, old friend, what are you really here for? Please, stop playing me for a fool, Dimitri. I know you of them all, and that it is this you're here for. What's next? Are you going to kill me for it? Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler skin in.
Oh, can I help you, sir? Blood. Team will need uniforms to get past security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Delica here, send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately. Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? This keycard gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Down. Take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Down, down, down. I found a shot. I found a door. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? Окей, okay, I have to leave. But you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Seven. Get changed. and key card are in the back. Come on, this way. In the bunker, on our own. No metal detectors for us. We're going around. Куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен для всех без исключения. Вы должны пройти досмотр. Товарищ, доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Пойдем, я нем кофе Дайте нам пройти. Принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. После Вичи, великолепно. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Пойдем.
Вы прибыли. Ах да, разумеется. То ваш командир, я не расслышал. Обязательно передам ему привет от вас. Сассолс, как это, мы должны следить за ним. Гирап. Они не будут счастливы видеть нас здесь. Ждите моего слова. Прежде чем Кравченко успел...
Come on, bro. Open the ball. Get the vault open. We gotta move. Open up the vault, Bell. before they get through. There's the list bell. Copy it to a disk.
Strike the plan B, go. Activate the gas. Southwest courtyard in five minutes. Bellicott is hitting the ride. Plenty of room in the backseat. Once we get off the elevator, just keep moving towards the courtyard. Get the charge ready, though. Time. Been waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. 
But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight, Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit guaranteed. What's up? I need a few minutes of your time to discuss it. You available? In private. 